All right. Oh, so no little Mac, but he's, uh, I think, switching off. Uh, no big deal. Obviously, he's going to be playing the Bayonetta, and Cloud is going to be his partner here. I think that's probably a better combo than Zero C Samus and Mega Man, though I do know that they're both very viable characters. Um, and there's going to be a ton of action happening here. There's not a whole lot of safe space in uh, not just this map, but this game. But this map in particular, not a whole lot to go with. And a huge combo coming out of uh, NBD. Keeping Mega Man off to the side, and it looks like center stage is just being completely controlled by Red Team. Ooh, I'm gonna call that team No Big Mac. And yeah, they're just controlling the stage here. Really great coverage of the high options from uh, Bayonetta, keeping Cloud on the ground. And they just uh, are not giving up a single bit of space. They're pretty high percentages, though. Over 100% now for Cloud. And nice, uh, I think that's a forward air. Nice little forward air there coming out of Zero Suit. Jumps onto his partner there. Does a little bit of damage. But 103, Mega Man still living here. And actually, they take a lead on green side. Not much, though, considering the percentages on Zero Suit are, are fairly high. And uh, Mega Man should be going down any second now. But if he can stay alive and, and pump out a bunch of damage, I think that's going to work out really nice for his, uh, for his little team there. Ooh, nice little edge gear, but I think he tacked that on the way up. So nice nice job there by Mega Man. Ooh, up airs for days. More up airs. Missing out th on that one, though. Ooh, tried to get a nice little combo there. I think a forward error probably would have worked out a little bit better. MBD. Trying to ledge guard this zero suit, but zero suit getting the best of it. Now it looks like things are kind of turning around in terms of stage control. Uh, a little bit more of a brawl, but things seem to be going green side's way a little bit better. Zero suit, I think if they can take him down right now, is going to even up the game quite a bit. Ooh, gets him in that little time warpy thing, but in the air, can't get full combos off or really solid combos off. Ooh. Yeah, center stage just going to green right now. They're just controlling it for days. Bayonetta goes down, and last stock situation here for no big deal. Also last stock situation for uh, his partner, Mac, but they are uh, they're struggling. They're fighting their way back. Mega Man seems to be the real issue here, just not dying, and uh, now has a pretty low percentage as well. Bayonetta going up pretty high, and uh, Mega Man just doing his juggle thing, man. Trying to edge guard from a distance with some projectiles. Great job there. Has his limit, so he might be able to turn things around here if he can land a nice uh, full limit on on uh, Mega Man. Ooh, just kind of tosses that one out. A little bit unfortunate. And uh, on a map like this, I think it's going to take a while for him to charge that. In fact, I think that was the only time in this game that he had it fully charged. Ooh. Bayonetta straight off the top there, and this is going to be a really tough thing to come back from. Although, in this situation, I think um, most players get a little complacent if they're in the 2v1. So, if he can land a... Oh, he does clip him! Off goes Mega Man. Unfortunately, he didn't get uh, both of them, which would have been almost the only thing that brought him back. Nice little spike there. And game 1 goes to Smasher 101 and Kiter. Didn't seem like there's a whole lot of uh, combo setups happening there from Red Side. Hopefully they can, uh, from No Big Mac, hopefully they can come back and find a way to throw down in game two. Is this a best of three or best of five? Shane's not going to answer me. He's too uh, busy with his phone, but I'm going to assume it's a best of five.
Fnatic team here. Looks like they're going to Battlefield. I don't know if that, how much better this is going to work out, but uh, switching off to Captain Falcon, and like I mentioned, I think character selection is going to play a pretty big role in how this all works out. Ooh, lands that uh, forward smash pretty much. One of the only moves he's actually landed this game, and it, it lands on his partner there. Ooh, that's sick spike coming out of Zero Suit. Only at 17% to 80% on Bayonetta, and it looks like Greenside's taking just an absolute dominating lead in this one. Up one game, up one stock, up a huge amount of percentage as well. Wow. Ooh, that's sick turnaround. I think that was his up B coming out of... Uh, coming out of Mega Man, but he is just absolutely doing work right now. Oh, let's go Bayonetta. Not quite, though. Doesn't go off the top. Looking for uh, some kind of a finishing move coming out of uh, Captain Falcon here. It doesn't look like too much is going on. Looks for the spike, doesn't get it. And uh, he's really having to deal with quite a bit of harassment from Mega Man when he comes back. A lot of projectiles being thrown. And he just, like, camps him out. Ooh, there we go. Ooh, sick setup, sick combo. But still doesn't finish the kill. It would have been really nice if that, uh, really nice for uh, Red Side if they would have gotten that one. But at least they're, uh, they are living here. They're not... They're not losing that second stock, which could really be an issue. But Mega Man at such a high percent, and Captain Falcon catching up to him almost there. NVD makes his way back. Damn, those projectiles. Blasting off. Yeah, this is looking really, really tough. Five. Oh, they're just dropping. They're just going. I think uh, NVD just kind of gave up on that one dropped off but four stocks to one this could be the most amazing thing ever or as I suspect one of the, one of the most depressing things oh Down he goes. So it was just a best of three, and uh, I think uh, no Big Mac. Just kind of gave up on that one. I'm going to jet, though. Hopefully somebody else steps in for commentary.